ONMD stock is uh, still showing a lot of strength and this session as you can see up 42.55% uh, uh, the news behind this rally among other things is that uh, the company has secured a three-year master services deal with an undisclosed medical technology company and in this session we saw a bubble uh, that saw it uh, it started price saw the price reach uh, reach 3.37 dollars just um, a few minutes after the market opened and uh, has since uh, pulled back in trying to contract this uh, volatility bubble and uh, maybe we might see what looks like um, more gains we, we might see more gains you know because uh, as you can do as things stand right now it's trading outside of its uh, price channel it's definitely going to come it's trying to come back in uh, maybe try to consolidate a bit more and maybe we're going to see something else so the gain as, as it is now is now 40 let's let's call it 42 42.05 percent and when we come back we'll try and see what has happened for 2.05 is the gain okay so uh, let's look at um let's look at it at um on our uh, trading view this is uh this is that strength i was talking about since i would say since the tuesday the 21st of uh, march it has just continued to spike uh but um it cooled off slightly on um sun i think on cooled off slightly on um cool off yesterday yes yesterday that the, the 29th of may i want to believe um, today it's now uh on the move again it's as, as, as things stand right now uh there are no fibonacci it's it's trading above above all of its uh, fibonacci projections on this uh daily chart and another thing also is that it has a very steep angle of attack there's a good chance um it's it will it should naturally um, if we had a if we had um, a price channel here, or uh, yeah, a price channel, you might see that uh, we'll be we'll be looking at a bubble. So expect a, a cool off to occur. Expect it to pull back and you know pull to pull back in. You know, uh, especially with this uh, steep angle of attack. So but if we have a look at its uh, 45 minute chart, we're, we're trying to look at we're trying to find projections here okay let's look at a four hour chart it's it might be very much similar to what we have here on this uh daily chart okay yeah okay it's trading below yeah there are upper projections here 3.39 is the most upward one and below that we have a 3.24 let's have a look uh, and see what we have on the 45 minute chart let's see okay yeah we have uh, projections we have one here uh what do we have what 3.2 3.2 dollars on the 45 minute chart um we're trying to see whether we can get anything much higher than that okay let's look at the 30 minute chart do we have anything do we have uh, anything more ambitious 3.21 3.21 is what has been calculated there let's look at the 15 minute chart Okay, we have uh, 3.09. We still have to go further up and see what what we, what we can see. What we can see. Five uh, minute charts. Let's see. 3.34. Okay. This is the most ambitious. So um, ambitious uh, so far. 3.34. Let's look at a one minute chart. 3.34. This is what we saw on the on the uh, five minute chart. Let's see. Here we have a uh, 3.4, 3.4 dollars. I think we have tried. We have tried, so we can use uh, 3.4 dollars, and uh, in, with uh, reference to what's going on on this daily chart, 3.4 dollars. Uh, we take that as uh, yeah, 3.4 dollars, and then we use the prevailing market price, which is around 2.83, and then we use the standard deviation. And then that way we might be able to find the probability of getting to 3.34 to sorry 3.34 and at 2.84 and then let's get the standard deviation here standard deviation is uh we're, we're going to use it 10 day standard deviation uh, 0 0.8764 0.8764 
let's calculate it's, we're trying to find probability that it will yeah so the probability that it will not uh, get there the probability that it will stay below 3.34 is at 71.584 the probability that it will get there is at 28.42 percent 28.42 percent the probability that it will trade between 2.84 and 3.34 which is the projection we are considering is that around that 21.58 percent yeah onmd on the move uh, disclose that um, they have secured a three-year master services deal with an undisclosed medical technology company. Let's come to the think and stream and see what we have. We had, um, yeah, it has since added some more gains. Yeah, it's pulling back into this market uh, grid, so into this uh, trading channel. And um, as such, it has, I think, it has roughly gained around 3% three, 3 or thereabouts so far since we left it here. So yeah, uh, scalpers uh, would definitely be making the most of um, ONMD. Have a look and uh, see what you make of it. We have a projection of a 3.34, the probability that it will get there with reference to its uh, prevailing price is roughly around 28.4%. Uh, and that's quite decent. Within a 28% probability, you can have a lot. There's a lot that can really happen, yeah. So uh, see what you make of ONMD on the move in this regular session of uh, today the 30th of may 2024 and uh, thank you very much for watching this video